emerging from the Norwegian Sea as a series of volcanoes. The land of fire and ice. I spent hours in every single location trying to capture the feeling of being in such a wonderful place, but it's almost impossible to do so. The feeling of being on a completely different planet. It was such a challenge to capture the raw power of this landscape. With freezing temperatures, storming seas, active volcanoes, the island's nature demands respect. For a few hours, when the sun is at its lowest, we're able to just get a small peek of the true power that crafted this island. But that ominous power is exactly what makes this landscape so wonderful and unique. Man, the weather is insane. My watch is dead. I was, I was using it to keep track of uh, real time, real American time over here in Iceland because they literally don't have night time. A little update, I just quit my job and I'm about to go all out into travel photography. And it is terrifying, but um, I'm really excited. I've been very strategic about this and it's honestly, just it feels more and more like the right decision every day um, and if it all goes down I will still be happy that I tried this I'm really lucky to have a lot of really amazing people who are helping me out through this process <laughs> sorry <laughs> this is weird because I'm, I'm sitting I'm not talking to you I'm actually sitting here talking to a camera to myself and uh, in a foreign country and it's weird to keep talking to you guys because I have no subscribers at the moment I have 10 five of them are probably me one is my mom and two are my only friends <laughs> <laughs>